To the people of Real Salt Lake, my name is Ian Joy. This is Kenny Duca. Welcome to the first version of uh, Scott Lake City. And there's Kenny's phone. Hello. Hi, sorry about that. Uh, that was somebody in no willing to give me a mortgage because I'm an <laughs> illegal alien, but... Uh, We'll keep, t we'll keep trying, we'll keep trying. Uh, anyway, is there any chance of us getting into this shop and I can get some iron brew? Because I'm sweating like a beaver in a wetsuit. Let's go. Who's that? Harry Potter? Doesn't mean nothing to me. Sorry, you can park the trolley there. You're Scottish. <laughs> I tell you what we'll do, Kenny, we'll leave the trolley there, seems as we're right. allowed to, eh? Right, well, we're alone. Cold Iron Brew, National Drink of Scotland. Now, this is what I missed the most when I first came over. Luckily, there's a company in uh, the United States that shipped the Iron Brew and they shipped me three free cases, so I'm pretty full up just now. Uh, so, get your cola. Get that away. Iron Brew's what you want to be drinking. Right, what we got in here? Oh, Ian, you're not going to believe this. What is it, Kenny? Haggis. You got some haggis? Oh my god. Is that me breaking place again? Now this stuff is special. <laughs> what is haggis? Haggis is this small creature that runs up the hills in Scotland and two of its legs are shorter than the other two so that it can run in a straight line round the hill. It keeps running around. It's, the, aye, it's, it's difficult to... It doesn't go anywhere else, it just runs around. It's difficult to hunt them actually because when you're running round the hill after them then obviously your legs are the same length and you want to run down the hill but they can run in a straight line all the way around the hill in a perfect circumference. What do you mean? So like the so left legs? So we normally legs, take we normally take the like Americans. That. Aye. The uh, left legs like aye, that. Aye, the, right? the, the, the right side's longer than the left side. Is that right? Aye. Yeah. What happens if you're chasing the other way around? We it's can't. It can't, <laughs> can't, 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 can't rolls in the hill. <laughs> so that's why you, you get a couple of folk to hide further up, aye. and then they jump out and scare it, obviously catch it. Aye. So we can only run in one direction, normally, basically. We normally take, normally take the Americans to uh, Haggis Hunt. You just made that story up. No. Is That's true? true. We take the Americans with short legs as well, so that they can only run. And we catch them as well. Cook them up. The Americans <laughs> love haggis hunting. And they, but they never it, catch anything. What does it taste like? Uh, again, it's, it's like meat. Spicy like, meat, Aye, spicy meat. Spicy meat. It's got a wee bit of zip to it. You but know? once it comes out of this, it looks a bit like, uh, like caviar. Don't it? Explodes. Looks a bit like caviar, it's like small and like mashed up and it's beautiful. Beautiful. Have you tried haggis? No. It's a good idea. Oh! No. I hate haggis. You've got to have haggis, neeps and tatties. Which is haggis, turnip, mashed turnip and mashed potatoes. And mix it all together. Oh. Maybe even a wee bit of tomato ketchup. Unbelievable. No, but haggis really is actually like all the nasty like uh, bits of leftover meat, and it's all cooked in a uh, sheep's stomach. That's the truth. So that was a little taste of home, Kenny. Um, we picked ourselves up some some goodies from back home, you know, some tea bags and some remember crisps, not chips and some candy bars or chocolate bars or what we like to call them sweets and uh that's, mine, eh? that's yours buddy and the rest is for me so it's been a great experience we really enjoyed ourselves i uh, hope you guys have enjoyed um watching us in action at the british store and i think the next time we're going to be in action again we'll be trying to get myself a kilt or Aye. get an even Aye. bigger kilt for kenny you raise the standard here at your dress sense by the way well so living in america you got a Scottish Stone Main Street for the next episode and we'll get yeah. Ian fitted out for a kill. Sounds good. Bye bye.